Greetings, hello everyone, this is Freya Enjoy. And uh, today I'm going to talk about the dark night of the soul. It's not going to be a long video. I will do that later. This time I'm going to just give some guidelines about what the dark night of the soul really is. People need to know what the dark night of the soul is. The dark night of the soul is your journey on earth <laughs> in this physical body. That's the dark night of the soul. You can begin to give light to the dark night of your soul by being more conscious by being more conscious about yourself and being more conscious about your own life how you live your life and what you think about there is some things that is really important for you to think of as you begin to it's coming people and they are very interested in what I'm talking about they can go to my YouTube channel and see my YouTube videos uh, so it's uh, very important that you know some steps uh, I I give you some steps now this is about you have to know that your brain is trained in a special program as you came to earth as a child you were totally innocent and you had no programming and when you began to come out to this world your parents and the society around you gave you program they programmed you the programming is layers and layers on your innocent self in your on your innocence that you were born with so the first thing you actually need to know is that you have been programmed this programming is for you to unveil you need to unveil the programming you have and if you think this is bullshit or you don't understand this just look at it this way so many people if not all people on earth are so impressed about all computers on earth and everything that is actually programmed cars are programmed uh, yeah everything everything is programmed look at this about you in the same way you are also programmed and this is divine truth I'm speaking now that's kind of cold to be cold to be able to discern and look at you in this way at the same time this is guidelines I'm not going deep into it now this is guidelines at the same time it's about to go in to your own heart space and to go deeper into your own heart space and this means that you are going to care about yourself your own life in a deep sense this is not about to do it in an egoistic way this is not about a selfish way this is not about to have a lot of possessions or land or things this is about your heart this is about how you love yourself how you love everything that is existing life on earth all other human beings all animals all kind of animals and all about nature mother earth this is about that love and it's not something you once will understand it's an ongoing process 
where you learn to go deeper and deeper into that love. That love is your freedom. That love is your freedom. And uh, this is the two very important components. You are highly more intelligent than any computer on earth human, human have made. Of course you are. You come from the stars. And then, and then you have to know that with this intelligence you can actually you can take away your old programmings of course there's people standing right beside uh, behind me here now never ever standing uh, anyone here on the backyard but now when i'm talking they're gonna stand exactly back here and talk because it's so interesting okay so i'm gonna walk away here so the thing is that you have to know that you are so much more intelligent than any computer are and you can take away these old programmings and do it step after step and of course this is a work that takes time but the more you go into it and learn it the more the quicker you're gonna go on and succeed and then also you can begin to program yourself with new programs this is a this is of course higher technology but it's the technology of love heart and about freedom true freedom and true love this is unconditional love this is about love that is for all and every human is it's a love that is for everyone. It's not something that is actually romantic love. Romantic love is from the 3D matrix ideas and programming. Uh, the true love is much bigger, huger. All this comes into the dark night of the soul because your soul is not one thing. It is like everything, it's multidimensional. So, uh, I'm a shamanic practitioner. So, so I, I have this uh, ability to see layers in people. And I can also see some, many people have what's called soul loss. A soul loss means that a person had lost parts of her or his soul. And to come into the true light of who you are and your soul, to have your soul back, you need to shine light on your soul and see what parts is missing. Because you, most people, have given away parts of their soul to powers outside of themselves. This is the old 3D matrix programming it's all about. So, I will say now, you can go and look in my YouTube channel about videos. About videos, they are all important when it comes to this, to deprogram yourself and to, to reprogram yourself. You take away the old programs and program yourself with programs that are about love and freedom, true love and freedom. And to win your whole soul, own soul back. And that means that no one else or nothing else will own, will own your soul. You will be totally sovereign soul and a free spirit. I will not talk more about this today. I will come back and talk and do a longer video. This is like a fundamentals, just fundamentals uh, about this. Uh, and the dark night of the soul is nothing some people experience. Most people on earth 
are still in this process of the dark night of the soul. Because the first step is you have to know that you are in this dark night of the soul and that you have to awaken from that and come more and more into who you really are and the light and love that you are. And this is all about words. In real life, this is all about your own life experiences. Your experiences of yourself, how you think of yourself and how you live with yourself and the outer world, what you meet, where you go, how you look, how you think, how you feel, what you experience. Thank you so much for listening to me this uh, beautiful sunny day here uh, where I am sending this from is from Australia on the East Coast. And I say thank you. If you haven't subscribed, just click the subscribe button and you will be a subscriber in my YouTube community. Have a nice day. Blessings all of you and much love from me, friend, or blessings.